expected frequency. So expected frequency is calculated with given information from trials or events. Now, to find expected frequency, so your expected frequency is just the probability of an event happening multiplied by the number of events. Right? Relatively simple. And I'm going to look at an example here. So in poker, the probability of getting a royal flush is quite low, and it's actually 0 0.000002, okay? So not a percent, just 0 0.000002. Now, if you were dealt 1 million hands, how many royal flushes would you expect? And this is what expected frequency is. So, how, so the expected frequency would be, yeah, how many royal flushes would you expect? Now, using our formula, we'd expect the probability, which is 0 0.000002, multiply the number of events, well, that's a million hands, and doing this gives you two. So you'd only expect two royal flushes if you were dealt one million hands. Let's look at another one. So if a die is rolled 1,200 times, how many sixes would you expect? How many sixes? So remember, it's just the probability of getting a six multiplied by the number of events. Now, the probability of getting a six on a die is just one out of six. Number of events, or well, we're rolling at 1,200 times. And if you do that, you'd expect 200 sixes to be rolled. Thank you.